At 31, Judge had a phenomenal start to the 2023 campaign, placing him firmly in the MVP discussions. However, his second stint on the injured list, due to a torn ligament in his right big toe, has caused the Yankees considerable distress. The team has yet to confirm when he can return. Welcome Yankee fans subscribe to the channel to receive the latest news from the Yankees. Do not forget to help us by making a donation to the channel, then we will improve the quality of our videos leave your donation and help the New York Yankees news channel. The Yankees are hopeful that the forthcoming All-Star break, due in about two weeks, will greatly aid Judge's recovery. However, as he continues to experience pain while walking, his return doesn't seem to be imminent. Both Judge and manager Aaron Boone stopped short of guaranteeing his comeback in 2023, adding to the growing concerns about the Yankees roster and their ability to compete without him. Carlos Rodon has a positive update for Yankees fans. Rodon, however, seems on the cusp of getting back after weeks of battling a chronic back issue. The lefty, signed by the Yankees to a six-year, $162 million deal in the offseason, pitched four scoreless innings and struck out four on Sunday in his latest rehab start for the Somerset Patriots, the Yanks' AA affiliate. I feel like that was pretty close to normal, Rodon said, adding, I feel ready. That's a decision we have to talk about, where I fall into the rotation and where they schedule it. During spring training, Rodon battled a forearm issue. When he got healthy, his back started barking, and a few weeks, cortisone shots, and rehab starts later, he seems ready to take the mound for the Yanks in a regular season game. Yankee fans subscribe to the channel to receive the latest news from the Yankees.